Hello everyone. Today we will discuss on uh, SRX selective packet based forwarding. Uh, the reason for this particular feature would be if, if you have a certain amount of land traffic uh, wherein uh, you know it is 100% trustworthy and you would not like it to be processed by a few of the security modules or let us say you, you, you have a sort of traffic wherein you, you do not want to you know subject it to your uh, uh, security rules and security processes so in in that way what you can do uh, is instruct your SRX to you know process the traffic in a stateless fashion okay so let us quickly see uh, the packet flow through an SRX firewall device so the first and foremost one would be when a packet enters the system as you can see it is it will be subjected to per packet policer then there will be a per packet filter okay then uh, after the subject to this particular condition of per packet filter it would go ahead and uh, try to match an existing session or if it is not it will uh, again initiate various security options such as screen static net destination net so on and so forth okay so whenever you write a firewall filter it will be it processed first and uh, in this case we write a firewall filter to completely avoid the security services provided by our SRX okay so by default Junos will used uh, flow based forwarding architecture configuring this will allow you to provide selective stateless packet based forwarding okay so for example if a packet matches the condition obviously condition in the sense you would you would subject it to most probably from source address or uh, I'm, I'm not sure about the destination address but uh, I have seen examples wherein it is matched from your source address and if, if, if a packet matches your particular condition then the action would be you know to accept it and subject it to a um, packet based forwarding mode okay so we have a very simple scenario to you know just see and uh, replicate this uh, feature you know, I have an SRX firewall who is on 9912.3 interface on gig 000 and I also have an MX router which is connected to the SRX which is on 9912.1 okay the interface gig 000 is in the untrust zone of your SRX so when when I try to ping from MX the IP of the SRX I do not ping okay so that is the reason uh, it is by default the SRX will reject everything which is coming in unless otherwise you configure something called host inbound services with respect to you know protocols or the allowed traffic now what we are going to do is write a firewall filter on SRX wherein it will bypass this and read this traffic uh, in, in a normal uh, uh, packet based way where it is generally treated as a routed traffic and it will uh, route it directly without having to subject it to security so in order to do it we we got to configure a firewall filter okay family inet net filter my filter is any name of your choice so i'll say hello 12.0 24 Turn one from my source address nine nine two dot zero slash twenty four. So this is nothing but my source address of my MX. Okay. So I have written a match condition. Now we have to see the the then condition. So then if I say let's see it's we have a packet mode. So it says bypass the flow mode for the packet. So let's say packet mode, so then accept, that's the general lock. I try to see the firewall now, so this is the condition. So let's quickly apply it to the 
interface which is on the SRX and this will be the MX will be sourcing the traffic the traffic will traverse like this and it will come on to SRX so it is in the inbound direction so family I net filter it will be my inbound direction and this is a filter let us do a commit check commit check succeed so and then I commit so we we have done the configuration now let us try to ping well uh, you can see the ping is happening now the reason for this ping is uh, it is being subjected to the packet mode how do I verify it I have given a log option in the firewall filter so let us say run show firewall log you can see and I see this there is an OSPF session uh, there is an OSPF uh, protocol configured between SRX and VMX as well so there is a reason why you know now you can also see OSPF coming up between both the uh, devices okay so if, if I try to source the uh, same traffic ping 992 which is my SRX from my loopback it will again fail the reason being I have not written any filter to bypass this particular traffic from source address all once so that is the reason why it is still failing thank you so much um, the the video um, is available on the YouTube channel I have written a post in my blog um, which which exactly discusses the same thing so I would give a reference of my blog as well and also I will upload the PDF thank you